68-year-old Pinky Nolwane lives in Dube in Soweto. She receives her pension at Ipilekheng Community Centre. Her 1,600 rand monthly grant supports six others. And like many South Africans, she's been worried as she's watched the South African Social Services Agency crisis unfold. I was so miserable thinking about, I've got credits that I take because this money is not enough. It's not enough, so I take credits some, sometimes for food, for clothing. I'm still worried because I, I haven't gone into the office yet. Usually, Ngoane waits for hours to get paid, but not today. Well, it went, it went fast today. I'm not worried anymore. I, I got all the money. Others were not so happy. Their main worry, the deductions they never agreed to. Worried. Okay. My children are getting hungry. Every month my money is taken off. Social Development Minister Batabile Tlamini visited payment centers in Soweto. The whole uh, thing is uh, humbling because uh, the beneficiaries are giving um, the government a, a, a second chance and, and therefore we have to try uh, by all means and uh, meet uh, the uh, timelines that have been uh, set uh, for us. Things weren't going as smoothly at the Ravasutu Community Centre in Tembisa. There, no payments have been made. The only communication, a hastily written sign. How could they come here on Monday and then there is no money and there's nobody at the pay point to actually say to the communities or to the beneficiaries, you will not get your money today. In the Free State and KwaZulu-Natal, beneficiaries have reportedly been paid without any problems. The current grant payment cycle will continue until Friday. Lauren Rose Joseph, Soweto.